Well, pretty much uh, all of North Texas is now under a heat advisory. And it still feels like it's over 100 degrees outside right now. I mean, you feel it the second you step outside in this kind of heat. It only takes a few minutes for a mistake to turn deadly. Here's Eric Alvarez. It takes about 10 minutes for the inside of a car to reach potentially deadly temperatures. It takes less than two minutes to learn the information that might save a life. When it comes to heat stroke, every second counts from how quickly the temperature rises. The temperature inside a car can reach 125 degrees in just minutes. To how quickly it can kill you. It absolutely can happen over the course of minutes. Police and paramedics joined forces at MedStar headquarters to break down what to do if you come across a child in a hot car. You want to pick a door window that is furthest away from the child. Like how to safely smash a window. Hold the sharp object against the glass, and then you want to smack it with a blunt object and how to perform CPR on a toddler. Take your middle two fingers of one hand, place it in the center of the child's chest, and press downwards. MedStar says Texas leads the nation in hot car deaths with 131 since 1990. Four Texas children have already died this year. MedStar says most cases are accidental, and preventing this can be simple. Have a stuffed animal or a stuffed toy in the car seat. When you put the child in the car seat, move the toy to the front. When you arrive at the destination, wherever you were going, you might look at the front seat and say, why is this teddy bear in the front seat of the car? Oh, that's right, because my kid is in the back seat of the car. A visual reminder that could save your child's life. In Fort Worth, I'm Eric Alvarez.